Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to this tutorial on how to create a supercell using Vesta. So in my last few tutorials, I'll be showing you how to do a variety of cool stuff using Vesta, which is a 3D visualizing software for solid systems. So in this tutorial, we'll be learning how to create a supercell. So here I have a silicon unit cell and I already showed you guys how to download it and how to visualize it and all that stuff now sometimes when you are work, working in the field of computational you know condensed matter physics or material science then sometimes you need to work on bulk systems now several of these softwares that are available they can only work on periodic structures so if you want to create a bulk system then basically what you want to do is you want to create a supercell which is just an extension of your single unit cell so in this tutorial I'm going to show you guys how to do that because it is useful for computational simulations on material science etc so just go ahead and open any of your structure files in my case I have opened silicon and then go to edit then go to edit data then go to unit cell and then click on transform and then just transform using these three values so if you want to extend it in the x-axis then change this value if you want to extend it in the y-axis then change this value if you want to extend it along the z-axis then change this value so currently i'm creating a two cross two cross two unit cell um sorry super cell and then just go ahead and click on ok yes ok and then click apply ok so now as you can see now you have a super cell and if you click on summary then you can see that all the lattice parameters have been multiplied by 2 so that is why it is called a super cell because Vesta is still treating it as a unit cell although we know that it is a an extension of the unit cell so now you can basically just go ahead and save this and then you can use it in whatever software you want to use it so that's it that's how you create a supercell and i hope you guys you know found this video useful so if you did then don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the like button thanks for watching and have a great day